What's up everybody? It's your girl Kristen and I'm back to bear some truths. And not the truths that you want, but the truths that you need. Well, they're actually opinions, but I'll let you determine if there's any truth to it. And so I made the move, I bumped her but I played it cool DJ dropped Beyonce, I asked her who she catered to She said I'm single boo, I just hope you single too But I ain't tripping, I'm just out having a drink or two A while back, I was having a discussion with a friend And we were talking about relationships And we ended up on the subject of how I approach relationships And how I deal with them And what was gathered from the discussion was that I may have a control issue I had never been told that, so I thought about it and I can say that control is a factor. So it is a control thing, but I wouldn't say it's a control issue. Because I feel like self-control in particular that I have maintained in my situations has helped me. I believe I have met men throughout my life who have far less restraint than me, but they wanted to label it other things. And that's fine. We can go sit on the therapist's couch. We can go to the red table and talk about it. But at the end of the day, they had less restraint. And I could see where the situation was headed and I was not interested in going in that direction at the time. So I exercised the control that I have over myself and the situation and I left. And I think that's something more people need to do. Now, not leaving necessarily, but controlling your situation throughout. There are so many things that we can control, but I think people run away from that word due to a power trip. Men may hear control and think, oh, a woman won't let a man be a man. And women may hear control and run because they think they have to be a submissive maid slave, which submission does not equate to being neither a maid nor a slave. Submission is perfectly fine as long as you submit to the right leadership, but that's another topic. Either way, in my case, I agree that control was very much so a factor. I do try my best to remain in control of my situation at all times, and I don't know why anybody wouldn't. As far as women, we have control. People would like to make it seem like we don't and make us feel powerless until they're ready for you to be accountable for something. Then it's all your fault. Be a single mom and see if it don't be, oh, I mean, that's on you. Yeah, I had unprotected sex with you, but you could have not let me. Child, please. So clearly there is control to be exerted and I've learned to exert that control. I've also learned to take the reins and leave a situation when the person I'm dealing with is not headed in a sensible direction. You know how people love to say, choose better? That's cause you control that. Be in control. When the whole thing about control came up between me and my friend, I could see what she was saying. And again, she pointed it out as the reason why I don't give way to the relationships that I could have. But at the same time, I feel like lack of control is what gets a lot of people in their relationship issues. So the angle towards me was that you're not in a relationship or you don't pursue relationships because of control. And I'm like, some people wouldn't be in the relationships that they're in if they had more control. Be in control of who you give your time to. Yes, people can be deceptive starting out, but once you choose to ignore red flags, you have chosen to waste your own time. You cannot control people being deceptive, but you can control what you choose to do when it comes to life. Also, be more in control of who you give your body to. People be complaining about folks that they purposely procreated with. Now, purposely, that means consensual. We both wanted to be there and we both did it under these circumstances. And I hope you both understood what those circumstances could bring forth. So that's what I mean when I say purposely procreated. I'm not talking about anybody that was in a more tragic situation. So there's that. Exercise some control. If you don't want kids right now and they don't want to wrap it up or take other preventive measures, control your hormones long enough to get up and go. It's that simple. Another thing that we can control but often choose not to is how we move on from relationships. People often talk about wasting time in situations and again, that's due to lack of control. 
But I think people tend to lose that control due to their emotions. But I still love them. Okay. You can break up with somebody because you no longer love them. But you can also break up with someone that you do love when you realize that you're no longer getting what it is that you need out of the situation. Or you may have fallen in love with somebody that you ain't had no business loving in the first place. And that's fine if you can realize it in time to make a clean break. But even if you don't make a clean break, you might have a little baggage or diaper bags. You still need to make the break regardless and just move forward and figure out how to put the pieces back together. That's the kind of person I am. I can like you. I can love you. But once you show me that this situation is detrimental to me, or even both of us in some way, but all I can do is act in the best interest of me. And it's up to the other person to act in the best interest of themselves. But once I know what is best for me, I will leave you. And that doesn't mean I didn't feel anything for that person at the time. But you know the manipulator's gonna hit you with that, you never cared about me, no way. Child, please. Call me what you need to, but goodbye. I know I cared about you. I know I loved you. You know I loved you too. But you're just here to put on this show in an effort to manipulate me or prolong things. But that's exactly where you need to exercise control. Let your no be no. Let your yes be yes. Let your I'm gone be I'm gone. And this is especially important when it comes to residual feelings. A lot of people sit up and say, I'm still thinking about them or I still miss them. And it causes us to go back. But I'm here to say no. If you already determined that this situation is not where you need to be, don't allow those emotional lapses to send you back. That is such a normal feeling. That is such a common feeling. But we tend to lack the self-control to not give in to those moments. I think about people that I miss for different reasons all the time. I miss the way certain guys talk to me, and that's a big thing for me. So this one guy in particular, he was so sweet with his words. And the outer shell that I present may seem like those words don't reach me or penetrate all the time, but they do. His words reach me whether I let them know every time or not. And I miss that. I miss those words. I miss those gestures. But I don't allow those things to drive me back to a situation that I already determined needed to be over for the reasons that I felt it needed to be over. And that's the truth I'm trying to get y'all to. Some of you are sitting out there right now missing somebody for reasons or aspects of your relationship that may have been good. But they were good aspects of a bad relationship. And I'm going to say that again. You may be missing good parts of a bad relationship. Bad relationships have good moments and good parts. It ain't always all bad. That's why that Tyler Perry movie had that whole notion of the list. If the good outweigh the bad, then stay. But if the bad outweigh the good, child, I don't care if the good outweigh the bad. If the one bad thing is that he just blacks my eye from time to time, but he does everything else good, Goodbye, and you need to get out of there. Get out! But I think about that often. I miss the way one guy thinks. I swear he's one of the smartest guys I've ever known. And I just love that intelligence about him. Anything he didn't know or any question I could ask, I could count on him to find an answer. Even if I was done with it, like, you know, don't worry about it, it's all good. He wasn't going to let it go. And he was going to come back to me with an answer. And I just admired his resourcefulness and intelligence. And like I said, the other guy, I admired his way with words, his sweetness, his gestures. Mind you, I ain't with now one of them. Because I can appreciate you for what you're good at. I can like you and love you for what you did, what you meant to me and gave me at that time. But I can also leave it behind if it's in my best interest. Now, I'm not talking about married people, let's be clear. I'm talking about those of us that are on our way if you aspire to be married because you don't have the time to waste. And I think a lot of us waste all that time based off residual feelings because you think whenever any old memories come up that that's a sign to go back. No. And I just want you to have more control and more restraint in those moments. You can miss somebody, you can reminisce. But don't go backwards. 
because all you're really doing is holding yourself back from the things and the person you deserve. You can have emotions. Your emotions shouldn't have you. So I'm going to leave it at that. Let me know in the comments what you think about these truths that I think I've shared. And of course, the truth is subjective based on our point of view. So if you think everything I sat here and said was hogwash and there's no truth to it at all, I want to see that in the comments too. Y'all know I'm always open to a good old debate as long as we keep it cute. So yeah, I'm Kristen, back at it with the Grease Single. Um, check us out on social media, like, follow, subscribe to us on YouTube, and check out Jervis McGee Music. He provides my theme song and all my music needs. So yeah, I will look for you in the comment section. I just want you right now. now. Nothing else matters right now. 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 Can I get you by yourself somehow? How? And show you how I really get down. I just want to show you where I live. Now. Baby, we can talk and chill. Baby girl, I'ma keep it real. Is this better? Okay, it looks like it. Let's go. What's up, everybody? It's your. Show me what's up. I can care about you and love you. My light didn't change. It's the time of day. It means. We both wanted to be there and we both did it on the side. Ah, you was on the road. A lot of people sit up and say, I'm still thinking about them or I miss them. And it causes us to go back. But I'm here to say no. Oh my God, I said no and I forgot. Oh, okay, let's start over. But I'm here to say no. Put too much into that no, you forgot. I'm getting dark. Okay. Child, I don't care if the good outweigh the bad. And the one bad thing is just that he blacks my eye from time to time. Mm -mm. This is the one more take. Yeah, Lord, the sun done went down. I should have. Uh, it don't matter. Let me know in the comments what you think about these truths that I've shared. Um, ah. Ooh, the sun went down, changed my whole surroundings. Baby, I, baby, I had to stop to eat, okay? I, I couldn't even, I couldn't even talk straight. <laughs> it's so hard, I was struggling, I was trying to get down. I was like, no, you had to pause and come back. Try to make sure ain't nothing stuck in my teeth. You know how hard it is to floss with red lipstick on? Can't, cannot, can't, cannot. It's, it's the same thing. They work the same way. You, you ain't hung up on nothing. Can't, cannot. Same. Okay. And yes, this is my brush. I gotta keep this brush handy because the weed be doing different things between uh, takes. I have to try to uh, keep it looking consistent. Be in control of who you... Be in control... <clears throat> One more time, it's gonna be a long clip. I've never done real lips for the camera. It's always neutral or brown or something. I love me red, honey. Fierce. Mm -hmm. Now, now purposely, that means consensual. Now, purposely, that means consensual. Ah, no. Okay. Now I'm not talking about married people, let's be clear. I'm talking about more time. Now I'm see, I already see, I already started out bed. One more time, okay? I'm not even sure why, because I think the other takes are fine, but one more time, because God knows. 